morning. It is Thursday? Wednesday? Wednesday, right? Wednesday. And we're here on the bumpy roads of southern Manitoba. On our way to Carmen. We just left Morris and we're headed west right now on uh, this highway. Whatever this highway is. I think it's highway. Is it 23? I don't know. Just bumpy, bumpy. Making sure all the bolts are tight, I guess. Making sure I secured the load properly. We're going to drop off our piece in Carmen. Rush over to Oak Bluff, try to get that piece delivered today yet too, and then we're gonna head home for a few days. Diesel has a vet appointment, and we have a barbecue on Saturday afternoon at our house. Ow, ow, bumpy, bumpy, bumpy. Okay, I'll talk to you guys in a bit. Welcome to the vlog. Don't forget to subscribe, hit the bell so you get notifications, and hit that like button if you do like it. Got my first delivery done here in Carmen. Now just to quickly zip over to Oak Bluff and then home. It's a nice quick delivery. You know, just one pallet, one skid. Just get it out of here. I don't want it. It's weighing me down. You know what I mean? So my windshield is still all full of bugs. It's going to stay that way until, you know, late fall. So we might as well just get used to it. It's just the way it is up here. We got a lot more bugs than you do in your area, I'm sure. You could always have a little competition. Who's got the most bugs? I'm not really into that, but if you want to prove to me that you got more bugs in your area? By all means. Well, we're uh, 58 kilometers away, about like 35 miles or so. We should make it. It's 3.09 right now in the afternoon. That means we'll be getting there before four o'clock. And they shut down at 4.30. And it's only going to take them five minutes to get it off the trailer. So I don't feel bad showing up last minute. It's close to 45 minutes before they shut down. So I'm okay with that. We're done. So this here, this first one's going to Alberta. This one's going to Kamloops, British Columbia. That's also going to Kamloops. These two are going to Olds, Alberta. And this one here is going to Lethbridge, Alberta. It's a pretty mean looking machine, eh? <laughs> There's the pallet I just delivered here now. It was sitting on the back there. Look at these things, eh? I'd like to put this on my pickup. That would be awesome. <laughs> you know, there is a company just south of me in Minnesota called Matrix. They make things exactly like that that fit on my pickup. It'd be so awesome in wintertime. Go off-roading with that. Oh, well, okay, let's go home. We gotta bring this truck, uh, Get it ready for the shop. One of my beacons is burnt out on here. My driver's side beacon doesn't, my strobe light, it's, it's burnt out, so they gotta replace it this weekend. And then we'll continue with this load Saturday night or early Sunday morning. Getting closer to home here. Still a little ways to go yet, but we're getting there. I love this summer weather. Love it. Everything is just so much better in the summertime. I can't wait till I get to the point in life where I can just go away for the wintertime and be a snowbird down with Jade and John on the Gulf Coast in the United States. Whoa, what's going on here? Look at all this, look at all this. Whoa, bumpy roads. Oh dear, oh dear. I need a truck to go through here. Oh boy, oh boy. Okay, we got this, we got this. All right. I can't wait till we can get a better second vehicle for Brit, and then I can drive the pickup again. Uh, just for now, the pickup's a lot more reliable for her to go to work and back. Uh, it's also a lease, and she drives a shorter distance than I do, even though I drive less because I only go back and forth, what, once a week? So, uh, either way, it's a reliable vehicle. I don't want to have her in a vehicle driving every day that might possibly break down. Like, this thing's got almost 270,000 kilometers on it. I don't know how long it's gonna last. So I don't mind driving it right now, whatever. But uh, we are working towards one day getting a better second vehicle for her. And once that lease is up on the pickup, I wanna exchange it and lease a 2500 anyway. Maybe even I can, maybe I'll be able to afford a Duramax by then. Who knows? Probably not. <laughs> but a man can dream, right? I'm a dreamer. That's the way things are made. What's this? The sign right over here says bumps ahead. 
You don't say. You don't say, where are they? Where are they? Where? I don't see any bumps. That sign should have been back there. There was bumps back there. No bumps here. Heh. <laughs> Alright, well, we'll be home in uh, well, a little while yet. Mm, now that I'm home, shower. These are the leftovers from the scalloped potatoes I made a week or two ago. Mm. Mm. Supper tonight. I'm so hungry.